hi guys welcome back to my channel love is a beautiful thing yes but it's one thing to be loved and it's another thing to love someone what i'm saying is it's one thing to be in love with somebody and it's another thing for the person to love you love is a beautiful thing and it's season of valentine like it's valentine's day today oh my god i can't believe that yeah it is so lots of us have found love some people are searching some people are yet to some are not even feeling bad about it some don't even want to search some are just sitting some people are digging deep some are you know just searching and seriously in the search but then love is a beautiful thing and it's so good to celebrate a day like this but i want to say something it is not a day to celebrate it's not just today it's not i mean celebrating your loved one is not just for today it should be something we do every day it should be a lifestyle yes it shouldn't be something we reserve until it's another 14th of february and then we celebrate valentine's day come on it's something we should do every day but hey guys how are you guys seeing my new hair look so I decided to go on this hairstyle which I've been yearning for for the past one year having this fringe look and all of that for the past one year but then hey I made it through and I got my hair on so if you like it hit the comment section and tell me how beautiful I look even though I know I look very beautiful okay so back to what I will, I'm going to say today we should look out for these three things on Valentine's Day now lots of us feel the pressure we we always have this pressure on we feel so much you know there's this anxiety and all of that when it comes to love and you know valentine's day what do i get for you what do i get in return you know the expectation is just too much and people in turn have this you know we 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 tend to put so much pressure on ourselves when it has to do with valentine so i'm here to say that we should ease on the pressure it's not a day that we should you know have so much pressure you know don't make a mountain out of it so many persons are like i don't have a vow i am single i don't even have someone it's okay for you not to have a vow it's okay for you to be single it's not a crime i mean you definitely find someone when you when the right when the time is right and you should also make yourself prepared to if the person comes you know what i'm saying but then we shouldn't put pressure on ourselves when it has to do with Valentine's Day. Like so many persons are angry. I don't have someone, nobody to take me out on this day. I don't even have a date. Yes, it's fine. It's fine. It's you just have to be calm, okay? Rather than pressurizing yourself, rather than putting pressure on yourself, and then you end up falling into the wrong relationship. And after Valentine, ah, you can't even look at his face again. Tomorrow you can never look at her face. So it's okay for that day to pass without you having someone, but it's not okay for you to you know to, for you to remain sober you just need to calm down take a chill pill and then it will come love will definitely find you like they say it will find you so i i feel that people shouldn't put so much pressure on this day people shouldn't be pressurized people shouldn't you know there's this rush hour everybody's rushing to do one or two things in order to make the day colorful and all that it's okay to do all of that but i feel that we shouldn't put so much pressure on ourselves when it has to do with valentine we should really calm down you know um examine whoever we're going out with and so that we don't go into we don't fall into the wrong relationship so like i said i'll, I'll be talking about three things that you shouldn't do yes three things you shouldn't do on valentine's day one you shouldn't go out with someone you know that you're never going to date this person you shouldn't go out with someone that you know that this person i don't even like him from adam i don't know him and i don't like him but because you want to fill that vacuum of valentine's day and then you go out with that person and you know you raise the person's hope high that something is you know coming something is coming on the way or something is cooking and at the end of the day nothing is even on nothing they fire safe at the end of the day you guys are not even meant to be together so i think we should calm down on the pressure reduce the pressure for valentine's day and we should you know love naturally and let love find us find us naturally another thing we should you know try to avoid on a day like this is this i must find a man i must find a man syndrome especially for the ladies i must find a man syndrome a man must buy me a gift something must happen on valentine's day he has to give me that ring on valentine's day you know it's 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 cool to think some of these things but it's actually not so nice when you begin to have it on your head and it's 
mounts a lot of pressure on you and you begin to you, you're so paranoid if it doesn't happen the way you're thinking it and it's it, it's really crazy but then we should try to minimize the way we see these things you must not find a man on valentine's day valentine's day is not a day that you must find a man it is not that day that you have to find a woman it's just that day to celebrate love you can actually celebrate love with your family and you know your friends it is not the day that there must be a man like i hear i hear so many persons say ha oh, man i need to get a guy for this valentine day but then what happens after valentine once valentine is over what happens to both of you so the thing is it is not a day for i must find a man syndrome you just need to you know exercise patience so verify whoever you're going out with and make sure you're going out with the right person hey guys thank you so much for watching this video if you know this video appealed to your heart like you love my video please give this video a thumbs up and enjoy your valentine celebrate valentine with the person you love the right person so hey guys before i forget don't forget to subscribe to this channel more videos coming your way on this channel and if there's anything you need to say please hit me up on the comment section i am right there waiting for you thank you guys for watching see you guys in my next video bye